I like moments like this when they can just be normal. Don't gotta think about shit. Just live in the moment. Lines we cross. Okay, now the music can drastically shift. Oh no, where's fire coming from? Oh, sorry, so it landed. Oh, they gotta put out the fire. Go now. Go, Which means they gotta cross the line. Oh, shit. Alpha obviously seen that satellite too, so she's gonna be in the area. I mean, I'm glad they prepared for this and had, you know, fire extinguishers. I don't even know why they dig this hole. I'd be lost. Why well, I'm not a firefighter. Oh yeah. I heard of setting a fresh fire to put out the old fire. I've heard of that before. Oh, is that what they're doing? That's why they did the ditch. Okay, now I don't think about it. Oh, they're gonna I know they're hot too. Alpha, if you just sent walkers, you a bitch. I feel like she would too. All right, battle stations. Oh my God. Yep, that's Alpha. I knew it. I know it's, I know it's her. Cause they cross the line. Like, yeah. Holy fuck! I mean, the group is good, but oh my god! Embers. Love teamwork. Fearless as ever. Backup has arrived. Oh, Sadiq. Oh, so Alexandria came through. Okay. Okay. All right, I need you to get on up, sir. That was a whisper. I could try to grab her. Was that a whisper? Oh no, I don't even know. Well, I mean, I guess Walker is going to try to grab her. She just slipped the boat. These motherfuckers on fire. You can't even touch these motherfuckers. Really. Shown grabs, flawless as ever. Real yeah, motherfucking Dixon, OG. Nobody died. I can, I can relax for a minute. I don't even think I was breathing that whole time. Eugene, let's go. I just need 
20 minutes. You get zero. We gotta go now. Ten. Just 10. We should excavate and transport this satellite to our vehicles. I believe there may be invaluable technological implications for our communities. If I'm able to retrieve any of the useful bits from inside, I'm not asking. Oh, my God. <laughs> Here we go. Luke, Magna, everybody, come on. We'll help him with the satellite. Five minutes and out. Mr. Grimes has spoken. Okay. Ingenious. What about radiation, man? Uh, there's radiation all around us. Certainly there's radiation from space, but every one of us is already affected with some kind of nasty that changes us into epidermis epicureans at point of RIP. I mean, I don't understand what you're talking about. I get that, man. I'm gonna get superpowers today. I'm on it. Cut in about 10 minutes. <laughs> you think I did about 10 minutes? Right. <laughs> Maybe this buys us some goodwill. This helps them too. We helped our people. That's enough good for me for now. Mm hmm. Oh, they went to check on Office Herd and it is gone. That is not good. Still want to run away together? Otherwise, we're going to have to punch holes in all them boats. <laughs> oh, the fucking phone. What are we looking at? <sighs> oh, shit. Oh. Carol been waiting for your ass. I'm talking this ended up. Wow, that was the season premiere of season ten. <sighs> All right, I stopped breathing like that last ten minutes of the fire. Um, wow, a lot to talk about. Um, it was kind of cool that we got to see the different the day from different perspectives. Um. You got to see a little of uh, Michonne and Aaron bonding and kind of, you know, Aaron's anger and paranoia and uh, everything that's been happening when Jesus died, after Jesus died to him. So he's uh, trying to fight that and he wants to fight back. I'm sure there's a lot of people who like him who want to fight back, like Carol. You can already see the way she was just staring down Alpha. They're going to go at it. And Aaron's probably one of those people who wants to go fight too. Um... Sadiq, he is paranoid. He's has his PTSD and he's stressing. I can't blame him after what happened if Alpha cut off everybody head in front of me. I think I might not be no good after that either. Uh Michonne trying to hold it down. She's trying to keep everybody in line. She's trying to She's trying to abide by this peace for as long as she can. She's trying to let her kids live a little bit. And teach uh Judith was telling RJ about Rick. That was heartbreaking. That's sad. I guess they really never told him what happened, but he is young. But, I mean, at least he knows the story one day. The brave man was your dad. So, that was probably, like, the little Easter egg, though, that that Michonne is going to leave and go find Rick. I mean, I already knew this. I, was, I know inside my heart that's what's going to happen. She's going to leave to go to the movies and find him and bring him back to her kids. Um... I would like for her kids to go with her, but I can't see them taking Judith, specifically Judith, away from the show, especially since she just joined. Well, Kaylee Fleming's the older Judith. Um, so we'll see what happens with that, but I feel like they just set that up. Um, Daryl and Carol. Carol, she took some time off and went away because she already knows that when she, when she gets her sights on something, ain't nothing stopping her. And I think she really didn't want to mess stuff up for the group, their little piece, but it's inevitable. She's trying to stay away for herself, for well, for Alpha's sake, and for the rest of the group, because Carol, she would go to war. <sighs> and I already think, just by that eyesight, it's going down. Daryl's trying to get her to stay, but Carol knows it's best for her. And <sighs> Daryl's trying to hold on to his friend and have her you know, just kind of 
in a way move on and move back into society and you know but carol she's just like i really can't be here right now because it just brings up bad memories especially with ezekiel being there you could tell she really was short with him and didn't want to talk but uh so then they let negan out he's farming but he ain't stupid he knows when shit gets bad and people get scared and stuff they're gonna point their fingers at him like they just did with lydia and uh she really didn't know how to take it she just I didn't, I didn't even think that she couldn't read. Like, I mean, I guess growing out in the wilderness, you can't read. So, but I mean, she got some good survival instincts. But that's the others who don't have. Um, what else are my thoughts? Um, i trying to remember everything. Uh, I like that they're trying to fill in some plot for Maggie, even though Lauren Cohen's gone. But they're still keeping trying to keep Maggie's story moving a little bit. I know they said they was working on bringing her back for season 10, but I ain't heard nothing. So I'm guessing, obviously Lauren didn't want to do it because her show was canceled. So, I mean, she's free as far as I know. So I'm guessing she's just waiting or maybe season 11 or maybe she'll show up at the end of season 10. I know they still film it, who knows? Um, That's pretty much all I got. I like the I overall I like the premiere. The I like the slow mo. The action was different. It was unique. You know, I mean we've been seeing walkers being killed over the past ten years. So it was kind of a great way to see it done in a different, unique way. Um the cinematography was amazing this episode. I loved it. And the the walkers look fresh as ever, like creepy as ever, like I've never seen them before. Uh shout out to Greg Nicotero for that. That was amazing. Um I'm excited for this season. I'm excited to see what else they got in store. Um, I already, I'm pretty sure I read online that the next episode was a big flashback for the whispers. So we're probably about to fill in the time of what happened during this. So I'm not expecting to see a conclusion right away because I already know how Walking Dead does. I ain't gonna see. I ain't gonna get nothing from the end of this episode in the next episode. I'm gonna have to wait. So whatever. I gotta wait even longer because I'm watching this on AMC premiere, so I'm watching this a week ahead of probably most of y'all. But I'm obviously not gonna post this video until after it airs. But uh, uh that's all I got. Um thank you guys for watching if you've watched this far. And uh make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And let me know what you thought about this episode and what you think is gonna happen going forward. What you wanna see in this season. Just your general thoughts. Show some love to your boy. Peace out.